<laughs> you stupid, stupid, stupid. What is up, my awesome YouTube viewers, and welcome back to From the Depths, where we're once again in the adventure mode. And as you can see, uh, well, we are a bit surrounded here. I was, uh, I was sorting out the ammo storage in there, and I was like, what the hell are we keeping, you know, shooting at constantly, non stop? And then I come up here, and I'm like, oh, we got something there something there and, and something over there and there's another little thing i think over there <laughs> good stuff indeed nice way to start the, today's uh, little let's play off let's go and have a look to see what the hell this thing is we have the stickiness the stickiness is back with us once again oh wow yes this guy he is quite fast isn't he but he is dead. Very good. Well done, Booty. Looks like our <laughs> anti-air is having a having a go. Lovely stuff. All of that destruction, it's just beautiful. I mean, yeah, it is made out of wood. And yes, it is the Marauder, everybody's favorite test subject. <laughs> Poor thing. Jesus. Marauder lives matter. Oh my god, we're sticking. <laughs> oh, that wood is just flowing. <laughs> Poor thing. Oh dear. Oh dearie, dearie, dearie. Me. And we have something over there as well in the distance or a little silhouette or something. Oh my god, there is a flying thing as well. Oh dear. We are really uh, surrounded. This is not the way I <laughs> intended on starting today. That is for sure. So I think currently I have you in patrol mode. I was going around picking up some stuff. Yes, yeah, so we pretty much we collected the last thing that I wanted to pick up right there. Very good. So we still have three, three targets. My God, we have a missile coming in towards us. Please don't. Oh Jesus Christ! Where the hell am I? Oh God, we're sticking. Oh, God damn it! Righty, there we go. It's right. Missile. Where was it? <laughs> Jesus. Oh no, please don't stick. Not now. Oh wow, that's a lot of misly stuff going on over there. Heading towards... Oh, he, he killed he killed the, the, the thing for us. Very nice. Thank you very much for that. We shall repay you with um, projectiles. Oh dear, he's dead. Oh no. Well, thank you for that. Little deep water guard uh, thing. Well done. Well, that looks like that was all of that taken care of. So back to the building. Today I'm going to hopefully start off with the uh, fuel refinery. And continue on the main structure. Install another another APS weapon. So if you do like what you see today, please remember to smash that like and subscribe button. Like it owes you money. Let us get started. Um, actually, let us also do that. Stop moving. Thank you very much. There you go. Very good. Alrighty, so down here we had the a massive box full of ammo. I've actually moved it all the way over here. Uh, so we've got the ammo storage pretty much here. And it's covered with applique on the tops, uh, top, left, right, and bottom, I believe. Yes, and bottom. The only place where I don't have applique is on these sides, at the front and at the back. Um, but it's most probably a temporary spot. We do have three meters. Uh, well, yeah, we do have three meters uh, of distance away from the turret's armor. And then, you know, we have the turret's components in there. But this is an, probably another temporary setup again, because, you know, we've just, I've moved the ammo, what, twice now? So, yippers. In here. 
In here, in here, what shall we do? Who would rate this zoo? As you can see, I've laid down... Oh crap, we're sticking. Um, I've laid down one layer of metal. You've got one layer of wood and start to build or place down some of these um, these stacks. Now these stacks, we need 77 flare stacks, 14 crackers and 8 um, cockers, 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 or whatever the hell they were. Um, yeah, so let us chuck a couple more down for now. So the plan is, or the plan was, um, as the the tower here is going to have like, you know, the, like the exhaust bits, you know, um, the smokestack kind of thing. I was going to try to use these guys. Let me just rotate this, uh, this boat around a bit just so we can get a better angle on those, on those enemies over there. Yeah, so I was going to try to get these, you know, to come all the way somewhere up here, like uh, about eight of them, but as we don't have pipes, it's, that would be pretty insane to try and pull off, <laughs> as we don't have pipes, uh, so yeah, that's, that's not going to be a thing, okay, let us see, let us see, let us see, we need, uh, what was it, 14 of these guys, Let us, yeah, can we go with that, do we do that, can we, should be able to, so that's two, four, six, eight, uh, well, fourteen, yes, learning to count with me. Now we need, um, oh dear, we're gonna, we, I don't think we have the proper space here, so we need eight of these. Yeah, we're not gonna have the room, are we? Um, that's six. Let's bring this up. No idea how many, how many, uh, things that we have, <laughs> how many flares I've got attached right now. No clue at all. I have to count them in a note. Um, right, so we need another two of those things. So if I do this, and that is that gonna? Hopefully that will attach. Let me just have a. To plug this in somewhere. I know it's underwater, it's not going to work, but yeah, okay, so that's that's all. Yeah, okay. So those um, will connect. We'll try to bring this up more so we can get our refinery hopefully somewhere up out of the out of the water. I mean, when this thing is moving, we should have a better altitude than that, but you know. Alrighty then, so after a bit of messing around, um, what I've done is instead of using the eight uh, cockers, eight uh, corkers or whatever the hell they are, not these ones, the other ones, uh, these ones, instead of using eight we're using six because for some reason I was either over, you know, there was either too many parts so you, you start to see a couple of them, you know, in red and at the same time, adding more flares, um, yeah, I was just not getting anywhere, and it was just pretty much overheating. I mean, an efficiency of 246, I think it's pretty okay. I mean, five material for 1,217 fuel per minute, so yeah, I think that might be okay. I mean, definitely can t tweak and tune it up, that's for sure, later on. Need to sort all of this, all of this, you know, uh, leftover uh, parts from our original uh, hull. So, yeah, unfortunately, I have to put it on like that. Now, that to me does look very meh. And I am keeping it up, up here still, just to say that I've got something in, in that main structure, not that, not empty, you know? So I do want to have, you know, parts, you know, in, in sort of like places, even though this would be in the absolute wrong place to have it. <laughs> but there you go. Uh, so, yeah. 
I'm gonna close all this good stuff up. Who right did this wild star character trying to knock down a flyer? Yes, I have put it in a box, <laughs> but it's only temporary until we get the uh, the whole towery thing built. Um, then we shall see what we'll do with it, just to try to make it like, I don't know, viewable kind of thing, if you are to walk around and stuff. Um, so yeah, this is what I've done so far uh, off, uh, off camera. Oh dear, we don't want that two there. Let's just get rid of that. Okay. So off camera I pretty much uh, just boxed it up, put it in a put it in a box. <laughs> just put in everything in their own little boxes. My god we are sticking again. And yeah, need to clean clean all of that good stuff up. But like I said, this is temporary. Um, we are still because I mean we're still going to be moving stuff around and all of that. So I, this refinery might even move somewhere else. I mean currently we're still you know one armor, one one layer thick. You can't even call that armor. So we have to double or triple this up for sure. And you know that's going to pretty much hit here. So like. Um, what was it? The hash can usually pass through that. I believe it's hash. I, used to, I always confuse the two. But yeah, oh god, sticking. Um, yeah. So if there, let us see this. So if, um, so if the fuel is not within ninety to one hundred percent, and if there isn't an enemy within three hundred meters, th three thousand meters, then then it can produce fuel. So if we do have, you know, between ninety and one hundred percent, then just turn off the refinery. So that's that taken care of. So currently it's off. Um, we have a lot of space here. Probably end up putting the applic panels up around here I think so that's that next bit of business is oh dear I'm um, probably installing the area around our next turret and installing our next turret
Alrighty then. So, <laughs> this upload has been split on a couple of days, uh, just very short, short sessions. And during that time, we've had our dev, our dev uh, test build has came out with, you know, the new ammo changes and all of that good stuff. And as you can see, we have all of this ammo. <laughs> we, only have, we only have nine on our construct, which is very bad for us. Um, our fuel has also, our fuel capacity has also increased. Our material capacity has also increased, I believe. And um, what I've just done is I've turned off our fuel refinery. And with that, I have also been working um, on these. They don't currently, they, they don't have the prop texture. Currently they're using um, just, you know, a random bit of machinery texture there. But, you know, that they, they, they just need a new texture. But, um, yes, we do have, you know, fuel refinery piping and all of that good stuff, which allows us to... Um, connect our fuel refinery and you know in any sort of like shape rather than having to connect the components to a components to a component for it to work we can now attach you know um, put it all together and we can have pipes in between to connect the bits and bobs the pipes do not affect anything in terms of efficiency they are just there to you know um, uh, connect the, the thingy together Let's get out of pause mode. Don't know why I'm in pause mode. Like I so. Right, so that is turned off. Let's get our fingers off the weapons. Let me just double check to see if this thing is off. Okay, very good. So yes, even the efficiency of this has changed. You know, the dangerous get the way the dangerous gases are formed uh, has changed as well. But yes, it will still eventually blow up if you do not take care of uh, that. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm going to have to install a couple of... Would you stop that? I'm going to have to install a couple of the um, ammo processors. Which I'm thinking... I'll put them in here. For now. I'm not going to have too many, either. So yes, let me know in the box, in the down there, what do you think about, um, you know, if you are on dev test and you've had, you know, some hands on, what do you think about the uh, the whole ammo changes? Can I fit some more anywhere? Except for, I don't want to cover up those ACBs because, you know, I, I want to use them. Um, we could probably put one, two there. Do we have any more spaceness? Doesn't look like it. No. No. Okay. We actually may even need to install um, more RTGs. Perhaps. We shall see. Anyway, let us come out of there, go into the map. Let's have a look at things. Yes, because what I've been doing is I've just been roaming around and uh, just pretty much with waypoints and collecting stuff. <laughs> oh dear, we seem to be in a bit of a rough spot. Are we going to sink? Who knows? But what I do know is we're going to be installing uh, some missiles because we want to get rid of... Well, pretty much we want to get rid of those, these two, and these two. Because they're pretty much in the wrong place now. And they're going to be in the way when we're going to be making our main structure. Oh dear, are we going to... <laughs> are we going to end up sinking or something? What are we shooting at as well? My god, man. Everything is happening at the same time. Okay, anyway. Um, right, we want to install some of these uh, good things. I don't know if I'm going to go with them as clusters just yet. I think, you know, for now, I just want to replace the ones that we have on the back. So, yeah, they won't be clusters for now. And uh, what I've done off camera right here is I just made some space. Um, you know, where we can set this, this good stuff up. Right, so we get some gantries down. I think we're going to probably be going with the remote guided ones. 
they have been tweaked out quite a bit. Um, but yeah, we're probably definitely going to have to install some more, um, what you may call it, cards, general processing cards. Okay, so just that bit. Some good old ejector action going on. Um, bom, bom, bom. what else do we need? Nothing really. Uh, where is our center? One of those. No oh, crap. Okay, so one of those. Let's get this thing and turn that off. One of these. God, we are sticking. One of them. Um, um, I guess we could probably just block this off as well. Um, we're not using a lot of them, so perhaps you know this could help a little bit just in case something does, you know, have EMP. Uh, down here, let's just block it off for now. Very dirty like and, and cheap like. <laughs> dirty and cheap. Um, right, yeah, so we have that in the way. Yeah, that we'll have to do for now. So that is, you know, it's it's closed up, right? You are closed. Are you? No, you're not. Why? Why? <laughs> Why game? Okay, so now it is closed up. Very good. I hope. Um, what do we have up here? Up here we have a hill. I don't. <laughs> God. Uh, yeah. All right. Now everything is closed up nicely. Very good. Um, let us set up our mislees. Our mislees. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have four. Um, four are just going to be with the frags. And how do I want to do this? Put a start delay of. Four seconds, I think. So it's going to go straight up for four seconds. Well, kind of. And start to rotate towards the target. And then it's going to turn its thrusters on, hopefully. So I'm saying like four seconds. So it, so it gets out of the launcher, rotates, and then it's pointing at the target, I hope. So that is the idea there. I'm going to do... Copy to all launch pads, but what else? The th the other thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to actually uh, disconnect that one side. And over here we're going to have shape charge head and explosive. For now, just you know, so we have a bit of a mix of things. And uh, copy to all. And go back over there and fill that thing up. Alrighty, so that is that. That is our misly sorted out. How is our ammo doing? Our ammo is doing absolutely and utterly piss poor. <laughs> we, we still don't have enough to fire a single goddamn missile. Oh my god, man, this is so bad. I don't know what to do. Oh crap, yes, I really am a little bit stuck with this whole sodding ammo thing. As soon as I uh, loaded up, the, I had like about, what, 23,000? As soon as I loaded up, I just went, zip, gone. Because we do have room to install, you know, to put down uh, four cluster missiles, you know, in these in these sections here to the, to the left, and well, to the front and to the rear. And, you know, later on, once we sort our speed out, we can get rid of these and extend the missiles down further, um, you know, and do that. That that shouldn't be a problem at all. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to install our AI here. Um, up here, how are things looking? Oh my god, it's nice, nice calm weather we have today. Very good. And our ammo is still... Uh, 
<laughs> I'm always still <laughs> Ugh. fine. Um, perhaps you should install more ammo processors. God damn it, I don't know really. I'll let you guys decide for that. You guys tell me, you know, should we have more ammo processors or not? Leave that in the box in the down there. Um, I'm going to carry on building around here. So this we can now get rid of. Uh, very good. So goodbye. You guys have served us pretty well. You have been knocked off God knows how many times. And this is your final time you'll be knocked off. There you go. Goodbye. Thank you for, for, for your service. <laughs> righty let us get that out and pop that in excellent so yes our turret on the other side is looking like this pretty much um, before we used to have the ammo clips probably coming up to here which was bad you know so um, got rid of them and as you can see you know this is just the next stuff oh dear we're stuck and yeah we just go down to all the components. We also now have the force desire gauge thing. That means that, you know, if one of our, um, oh crap, we're gonna go through the gate. No, don't go through the gate, don't go through the gate, please don't go through the gate, don't go through the gate, don't go through, please, 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 please. And yes, I am pushing reverse. So yes, I was gonna say, we do have the force, um, gauge thing so if one of our um, gauge increases get destroyed and it goes down a couple of gauges in terms of shell size you know it, it sort of clears the clips and it tries to load up those um, smaller shells well with that they will it will no longer do that if you have that ticked which is a good thing oh very good we have killed something over there in the distance I am still trying to manually turn and get us out of the way of that stupid gate. We don't want to go through a stupid gate. Oh my, we have a lot of... Where in the balls did all of that ammo come from? Are we getting ammo from the destroyed stuffs? <gasps> no. Are we? Looks like we also have a little flyer coming in uh, beside uh, that dude that we are shooting at. So hopefully our Misli uh, will see some action as well as our Sea Wiz. Oh great, so we killed him and our ammo. Uh, I don't know. I may have skipped it. <laughs> I may have lost that bit. Oh dear. Why hasn't our thingies launched at the thing for... Thi Excuse me? Excuse me? What have I done wrong? <laughs> What the hell have I done wrong? Oh, well, there they are. Well, it's about bloody time you sort of like thought, yeah, we'll probably just go and, you know, <laughs> you know, go and totally and completely and utterly miss the target. What in the crap? <laughs> you stupid, stupid, stupid idiot. My god, man, how stupid can you get? That is, that is just crap. Honestly, um, yes. I bet a couple of you were screaming. You forgot to put, forgot to put your guidance on. God damn it. Okay, so that is done. I mean, you guys could have told me, you know, that I forgot to put it on. <laughs> that was the most stupidest thing ever. Why aren't my missiles working? Uh, did you plug it in? <laughs> Where is that stupid flyer now? God damn it.
Okay, so over here, um, over here we're gonna have one of our detection uh, setups, but I'm not gonna put it in today. Um, I'm gonna have a bit of a think about how I'm gonna do that. We're gonna probably be getting rid of these, and uh, but down here in this main construct, you know, we'll have a couple of actual fixed ones, so they're not, you know, on a spin block, but actually fixed. You know, looking at um, a direction because this setup has actually caused me some issues so yeah we definitely need a couple that are fixed um, in place anyway the seas seem very quiet for now I'm gonna see how long I have recorded and I will bring you guys back in a mo unfortunately I think we're gonna have to call it here on this one because I'm um, just looking up the the upload well the the, the editing bits and pieces uh, definitely have gone way over the time that I wanted to record you know I'm trying to keep things out like 30 to 35 minutes but yeah that's a bit hard uh, <laughs> so yeah really hope that that doesn't upset him um, you know or bug you um, because it's uh, a bit of a long one Hopefully you guys will also leave me your comments and suggestions below in regards to uh, any music that I kind of like mix into this. Uh, so hopefully you guys, you know, can just let me know, give me some feedback on that. If I should do it, if I shouldn't do it, if I should have something continuously going on or just when I'm building. So please let me know in the box in down there. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you have, remember to smash that like and subscribe button. I like that, owe you money. For now, my awesome YouTubians. Take care and I'll catch you all on the next one.